Hey fam, it's your girl, Miss Diva Trucker. I'm coming to you again. I forgot to tell y'all, it is, uh, the Powerball drawing is tonight. And it is over a billion dollars, okay? So have y'all, has everybody went and got their tickets? Even the people that have never played before, it's playing today. So I think y'all got up to what, 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock tonight to go get your tickets? What would y'all do, drivers... What would y'all do if y'all won a billion dollars? Could you imagine it? Could you see it? Could you name it? Could you claim it? You'll pay off everything and keep trucking. Ray, everything like everything like what? You could not possibly have that many bills. Uh, you would pay off everything plus more. What I would do with a billion dollars? So I'm going to name it. I'm going to claim it. If I won a billion dollars, okay, I would probably buy... You think I could buy Swift, CR England, and CRST all at one time? Like, we just gonna go ahead and knock them out, okay? We gonna buy all of them at one time. I'm gonna give everybody free uh, CDL training, okay? Free CDL training for the first, let's just say, uh, 10,000 people, okay? Everybody on my Facebook page would get at least $5,000. Okay, like I would just give everybody on my Facebook page right now $5,000 just for being friends with me on Facebook. You see what I'm saying? Because y'all had to hung out with me for so long, I might as well break y'all off a piece, you know? Uh, what else I would do? Uh, you ain't gonna keep working, d -Will, you not gonna keep working with no billion dollars, okay? It ain't gonna happen. You is not gonna get up in the morning and clock in somewhere for me. You wouldn't keep working if you got a million dollars, okay? If they gave you $500,000 right now, you would tell them that you ain't showing up tomorrow, okay? You would tell them that you would not show up tomorrow. But I'm just sitting here thinking that if I win the million dollars, do y'all know how many people didn't pay their car note, didn't, uh, didn't, uh, tie, didn't, uh, waiting back on the house payment the mortgage and all that kind of stuff because they waiting to see you know if they gonna hit the big one you think they holding off to their bills not paying the insurance going on vacation for six uh, six months you'll be on vacation forever that's all you would do is be on y'all got to think bigger than that we talking about a billion dollars we ain't talking about a million dollars you got to think bigger than that buy a brand new freight liner and act like i just got a lot <laughs> Y'all think it's small. Y'all think it's small. We got we we buying companies. We not just buying freight liners. We gonna buy a big. We gonna buy. We gonna buy a big company. Buy the trucks of the company. We gonna buy freight liners. We just buy them out. Okay, not just one truck. We just get the whole company. Uh, we gonna hire people to work for us. You know, like the big people. We'll hire all of them to work for us. You would never have to do anything again. Could you imagine somebody in um trucking won a billion dollars today it is a billion dollars y'all i mean the mega ball the mega is what 1.2 million billion um how much would you get to the church that's what i want to know if you want a billion dollars today how much would you give to the church okay how much would church get they're gonna get 10 percent you're gonna get a lord 10 percent you're gonna tie 10 percent of your billion dollars to the church you could go build your church, okay? And then you could also be the pastor of your own church, all right? Um, go on vacation out of the garden. garden. <laughs> Y'all are thinking way too small. We talking about a billion dollars. You could change the world. Don't you think you could change the world with a billion dollars? We'll go get Prime first. Let's go buy Prime first, okay? We gonna give everybody, um, everybody that paid half of their truck. We gonna just, you know, write off the rest. You know, we just, you gotta do something big with your billion dollars. You just can't be going to buy a truck, uh, quitting your job. You gotta go out there and ball till you fall. You got a billion. You don't need no more money after that. You know what I'm saying? Would you pay your taxes off like right away or you just gonna make payments to it? What you gonna do? Have y'all sat and thought about it? You gotta name it, claim it, believe it, receive it type thing, okay? You know, you and you can't win it if you ain't in it, 
that's one thing you can't win it if you ain't in it so but yeah i'm getting ready to go over across the street so as i get through washing my clothes i'm gonna take the rest of these quarters you see how we got these quarters i'm gonna take the rest of these quarters that i don't i don't uh i got from not using and i'm finna go buy my tickets now i don't know how to play okay i'm finna go in there and do the quick pick thing and uh tell her i want the uh what is it you got to get the power play right you got to get the i want everything i'm gonna go over there and tell her i want everything now how much money i'm gonna spend on it i don't know i think 20 dollars would be okay you think that's okay hopefully i know somebody that's playing too and they'll play you know and and maybe that'll work that way um do y'all got some suggestions of where you should go buy your ticket at like you know buy it at the loves buy that what 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 gas station should you go and buy your ticket it seems like everybody that wins the powerball or the mega million or however they win from somewhere up north it ain't never nobody in the south okay it's somewhere up north that they win some crazy place so but i believe it's gonna hit tonight the lord told me look the lord told me that the powerball gonna hit tonight this this is the night right now tonight is the night you know, they can just take that money and just divide it up to everybody that put 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 into it. But uh yeah, I was just sitting here thinking, wow. If I won a Powerball, what in the world would I possibly do? It would have to do with something with trucking to try to change the industry. We would get rid of ELD. I would just let y'all run however you want it. Forget it. I'll pay the fine. You know what I'm saying? You know, we have to do some outlaw stuff like that. You know, um, we would just be buying up everything. Just buying up everything. Um, but yeah, I was just sitting here thinking, you know, if, if I won a Powerball, what would I do? It would be a whole lot of happy people, I'm telling you. Because, you know, I can't keep money. I'm always giving money away. But uh, other than that, y'all, oh, I also want to come back and just wish or shine my son, the youngest, y'all. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. Can we get an amen on this? Arshad has made 21 years old. Lord have mercy, y'all. I am so happy. I don't know what to do. He a grown man, okay? He is a grown man, so he is 21 years old. God bless his heart. He is out there in the world doing his thing. Um, I sent him something for his birthday. Uh, he said that he was... Um, you got your quick pick out of uh, Missouri the other day. Okay. Well, I'm trying to wait till the last minute. You know what I'm saying? I think I'm going to try to come up with some numbers on my own. I'm thinking about coming up with the numbers on my own. Have you ever looked at the lottery and the numbers came out and you was like, I thought of them numbers. I, I should have played them numbers. You know, those numbers are the ones I thought about. You know, but uh, I'm going to try to get some quick picks and then I might go in there and play my birthday or something, you know the day jesus was born you know something you know you got to throw something in there uh thank you getting being able to get a child to be 21 years old oh my god okay not in jail yet uh thank 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 the lord you know knock on wood hallelujah uh not in jail you know uh just i'm just proud of that that's an accomplishment okay 21 years old he is 21 years old our shine so now y'all y'all know i've been waiting on this day for a long time okay y'all know i've been waiting on this day for a long time he is 21 years old we got to get him in truck school okay i don't know what it's gonna take i need to go and do a background check i need to do but he told me he said mom i just got a job he working at the ford company ford plant or something and he's supposed to be uh changing oils and fixing tires and all that kind of stuff but one good thing uh he said mom he said they gave me a drug test and i passed it i was like oh hallelujah you know what i'm saying i saw hey he passed the drug test you know what i'm talking about so if he could pass a drug test at um if he could pass a drug test for his new job, then he could pass a drug test to go to trucking school, okay? So we got to put that in the works. We got to put it out there. We got to put it in the atmosphere. We got to name it. We got to claim it. We got to receive it. You know, I'm ready for him. I'm just ready. I'm getting the truck all nice and ready for him to come on out here and handle it. I don't care where he go. You know, we ain't got no preference. He go CR English, CRST. He go anywhere they giving out license. I don't care. 
Okay, I just need him to be in somebody's school. He ain't been in jail. He been working and he can pass a drug test. Hallelujah. God, thank you, Jesus. Have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, y'all just don't know how happy and excited I am. You just don't understand. You don't understand. We've been praying. We've been praying. Y'all, oh my God. So the only thing we got to do is check out these driver license, okay? Because I know back in the day, you know, when he was wrecking cars and tearing up cars and stuff like that, I know he got a ticket or two somewhere, okay? I just ain't checked it out. But I got to uh, some way, somehow, some form of shape to, uh, to, to be able to check that, to check his license. I know he got a good background. I know he could pass a drug test, okay? He got a work history. So, you know, we, we three out of five. Ripley, what's wrong with you? That's a little boy. Uh-uh, come here. Come here, come here. That's a little, that's a little boy. That's a little boy. That's a little boy. You don't do that. That's a child. He just come out of nowhere. But yeah, we got we got three out of four. You know, no ticket. Well, we can't say that yet. We got the we gotta go and do the uh we gotta pull the MBR report. Okay, we can't say no tickets yet, okay? But we can say no drugs, we can say he had a job, we can say he 21. Alright? Three out of four, baby. All we need is one more. So we may have to take up collection. I don't know. I, when I run this report on Arshon, on his MBR, and see what come back, I, Lord, brace. I'm going to be bracing myself. Okay? I'm going to brace myself. We might, um, as long as he, do, as he does it. But uh, I'm bracing myself. Uh, yeah. <laughs> He be on guard for real. He don't even play. I ain't even got to be looking out nowhere. He already got it. You see what I'm saying? I could be doing other things. He already on it. But um, I'm I'm excited, y'all. Y'all just don't know. I'm 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 I want my son to go to trucking school. I want him to go and get this CDL so we can get out here on the road together so I can show him how to make some money. You know what I'm saying? We don't need no girlfriend. I'm about to get rid of all that. You know, we about to get rid of all the girlfriends. You know, don't call them no more. We about to change phone numbers. You know what I'm talking about? We about to change the phone numbers. We about to get girl. If I got to kidnap my son, I hope I don't have to kidnap him. I hope I don't have, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do. He just don't see it right now, but I see it. I see it for him. I see it. I vision it. Uh, let me see. He has super speed of tickets. He's good. He he have a super speeder ticket. He good. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what he got. That's the only thing I'm scared of. I don't know what's on his MBR. So whatever it is, we might have to come out of our pocket, y'all. We might have to do a GoFundMe account, raise money to pay for our Sean tickets. I don't know what we're gonna have to do. Okay, I haven't checked into it. Um um, I'm going to have to check into it. I'm going to have to get somebody to pull that MBR for me. Go down there and see what's on there and see what we're working with. I don't care where he go. Whoever opened the door for Arshon, that's where he's going, okay? We'll take care of all that, uh, uh, the other stuff later. Let him get his basics out before he get on the truck with me. How about that? You know, let him do all that training and all that kind of stuff before he get out on the truck with me. And then, Lord, help him. Child, can you imagine me and Arshon on the truck? Oh, Lord, have mercy. <laughs> it's going to be something else. I hope so, too, David. I'm praying on it. I, I'm, I'm really praying on it. I got my hopes up high. I really do. I got my hopes up high, and I, I'm, I'm trying. I'm going to do everything I possibly can uh, to, to make it happen for him. You know, he's been... He's been doing pretty okay, you know. I'm, I, I might have to kidnap him. I don't know what I'm going to have to do, okay? I might have to take him by force. I don't know, but uh, no more students to... You know, we could dance. <laughs> no, I like my students. I like my women. I like I like to I like the uh the train the women. That's no problem, you know. But uh yeah, we could we could we could get him on that truck. He should know the basis. And then you got me. I mean, I don't have to talk all nice to him. I don't have to be all sweet to him and stuff like that. You know, because he my child. You know what I'm saying? So if I got to cuss him out and 
hit them upside the head, you know, to make them stay between the lines. I could do that because I'm his mama, okay? Um, but yeah, I ain't got to be all professional and all that kind of stuff, you know. He my child, so I could get it how I get it. Um, but uh, we're gonna pray on it, y'all. We're gonna pray on it. That would be such that would be something that I'm looking for that will make you know make what I'm doing worth the while. You see what I'm saying? There's things that you do out here for, for, for uh, your family and all that kind of stuff, but this is something that will really make it worthwhile. I don't know. I told him, I told him, um. I, w I actually wished him a happy birthday two days ago. You know, I'm so embarrassed because I, I called my son on the 21st. And I said, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to He said, mom, my birthday not till the 23rd. I said, oh, okay, okay. I'll call you back then. You know, okay. I missed it by two days, okay. Better early than late, all right. Better early than late. But, um... I told him to go down there and I sent him an application. Okay, I sent him the application to fill out, fill that out, put all the stuff in there, and all I gotta do is run that, I gotta run that MVR report. Lord, we gonna keep our fingers crossed on the MVR report and hope that come back. And if not, we I mean, if it got some things on there, I'm gonna have to work with it. If he got some unpaid fines or whatever, we're gonna have to take care of that and make it all right so he go and get his school. Right. But other than that, y'all, I was just sitting here thinking, I think my clothes was done, but I was just sitting here thinking, you know, have y'all really sat down and thought about if it was you that actually won a billion dollar mega Powerball, the mega millions of Powerball and all that kind of stuff. You need to sit down and think and put a list together of what you're going to do with all that money. Okay? Because I'm thinking about what I'm going to do with it. All right? So, all right, I got to go get my clothes, y'all. Talk to y'all later. Bye!